It's coming out. Ah! It's coming out. Yeah. You can see? Oh! It's coming out. And square uh -huh. uh -huh. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone, hope you're having a wonderful day. So I made this hunting video that has like over 1.2 million views and everybody has been asking, they want to know how Nigerians hunt. So today I'm with Egba Hunters Association. So they are going inside the forest now for a nice hunting and i'm going to follow them i'm going to show you how they really hunt so you guys that have been asking they have been dying to see how nigerians hunters do their hunting today you're going to see so let's go and if you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed to my channel please 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 kindly subscribe to my channel follow me and let me show you how nigerians hunt Show <laughs> This will be over. What are you going to do now? Now they're going to take position. Okay. And they call them ballet. So now the dog, the, the, the adaja, they go to enter into the bush now and start chasing the animals. So okay. when they are chasing the animals, the animals will come out. Okay. 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 Okay.
Okay. So they are in the hunt, we have different categories. There's what we call Adaja. Adaja Adha Adha is the one that they are going to go inside with the dogs. With the dogs. Yeah. When they get inside, then they start chasing the animal. Agbale. The Agbale are these people. They okay. want to stay beside the bush. Okay. Hanging around different points. All so right. the Adaja will go inside the inside the bush. No, the Agbale. This is Agbale. Agbale. Okay. And that's one over there. Over the Agbale. And so the Adaja. The Adaja that are going. Are, where are we going now? We are, are we following to, the Adaja. Yeah, we are following the Adaja. Okay. Now, you, as we are going now, we'll be seeing all the Agbale. They will be taking their, their positions. positions. Yeah. yeah. That's wonderful. Okay. Pass. Thank you. So their own is to take position. Yeah, they also take position and get set for any animal that's going to come, come out. out. And while they are taking position, so that there will be no gunshots against any anybody. Body. And they are level they should shoot. Okay. They have a they, they have level they should shoot. All right. Once the, the animal is up there, jump, they should not shoot up up, up, up okay. range. They it have should be to down, down down range. All right. So everything is with technique. Yeah. So not like an amateur will just go Going, inside. No, no, no. So now this is the Adaja. Adaja. They call them Adaja. So we have two people hunting. We have two set of people hunting. Adaja and the Agbale. Okay. Are no, these are the other they are going to start entering. Entering. So we're going to be careful because they are bad. They have taken position. Position. So until you hear a gunshot, so okay. After a gunshot, they will call people who carry the animal yeah, and they, so they come in to carry them. Carry, carry them and take them out okay. and position them in area where any other thing cannot get okay. to them so what are we going to do now so now we need to wait okay, until they call us because we don't need to follow them into the into bush, the bush. Yeah. okay so we can still walk now yeah, we can walk okay. because they are going this way mm. all right so we have a here yeah? and another person over there who they already took Daddy, position Daddy. the people who go inside to Help them with the carrying of the meat. Meat. The meat is the called Ashipa. Ashipa. So yeah. we have Agbale, yeah. we have Adaja, yeah. and, and we have Ashipa. Ashipa. So guys, <laughs> that's three, yeah. three points. So if you don't know anything about Nigeria hunting, See. this is Nigeria hunting, and I will be the first YouTuber to document this for you guys <laughs> to see. So let's keep going. We still have a long way to go. The hunting just started and it's still going to take and a very long time. Another, another, another Agbale here. And he's ready. He's gone. So, let's keep, let's keep going. Okay, you were talking about what they did. On, on, the, on the road there. Yeah. Yes. It's called Washino. Washino. Washino means okay. that there will be a talk of a prayer. Mm -hmm. That will not shoot ourselves, there will be no injury. We we'll go, we we'll kill animals safely, but there will be a rules and regulation of the way you should shoot, okay. the level you should put your gun. gun. And you make sure you, before you shoot, make sure you see what you are shooting before you, before you, you shoot. shoot. So, those are the necessary things they normally do before they go for the hunting. Going now. We are going to the part. Okay. Because the are balanced now. They need to be in different parts. We can have more than 50 are balanced. All right. Now, on that thing again, after, after the whole day, okay. after the whole day now, there's going to be all the meat they kill and they will not bring it together and burn it. Oh, okay. Yeah, they will not burn it. Burn it? Yeah, after burning it, they will, they will slaughter it. everything they will, they will and slaughter, they share it. They share it among With, themselves. Among themselves? Yeah. So it's not like they are um, hunting now to sell. This one is... No, no, no. This is what we call uh, Akpakpo. Uh, come, coming, to, uh, coming together to hunt, to hunt. and there are different ways at times uh, the hunters can ask if hunters have something to do maybe you want to do naming okay. or 
birthday, or any, any party. party party you want to do, he can call for the other hunters to come and help, help and him assist. assist yeah. And they will come there and kill any animal being killed. They will give it to the so person. The person. Yeah, so it's not like they will take it home. They will no, give no, no. it to the person but who wants to do it. This one they want to do now is about all of them coming together to kill and share. Share. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> wow. Look at that. Look at how green those lands are. And the land is really okay. So, why they prefer hunting before rainy season is for everywhere to be clear, right? Normally, they start hunting starting, they start the hunting anything from dry season. That's the dry it, season, yeah. They start it. So, during the rainy season, after let me say by six, seven months now, there's mm. not going to be the hunting will be totally different. Ah. Most of them will be going for farming, okay, how to plant. To let's see. Okay, so they are farmers as well. Yeah, they are farmers. Yeah, I can yeah. hear the noise. Yeah, that shouting means that that is the adaja. It's telling you that the animal is coming up or is okay. coming to the left. Those those are bale to be ready. Ready. That animal is coming. Mm. That is the shout you are hearing. Yes. From the eight months upward, they can be doing individually hunting, not okay. group hunting group anymore. Hunting. Because individually, they're going to be going into their farm now and start planting and doing the rest. Then towards in the evening time, they can go for individual hunting. hunting. So the hunters are going down and there are lots over there. So we just have to find a good positioning. So that whenever they shoot it so it doesn't get to us i know you guys want to see the whole action but they are very close right now and i can't follow them deep deep inside because of the way they shoot so not everybody are trained shooters they are not trained shooters but they've been doing this for a very long time the only way to avoid hurting each other is to give themselves a good positioning and whenever they do that they can be sure that they will shoot and they won't eat something they don't want to eat so now they are going deep down and the adaja are still bringing their dogs they are still shouting i'm sure you'll be able to hear their shout so we're still here waiting for or to hear the sound of a gunshot or them killing any bushmeat Man, this place, oh, just have to be extremely careful here. Yeah. Oh boy. So. What's the meaning of that? Guys, they tell that the animal, they have shot the animal, and the animal, the god didn't meet the animal. Oh. So, the wow that's another gun shot. shot that means that the the the, the adaja have chased the animals out so oh. now the people that are taking point now which they called agbale now Agba, yes. are the ones shooting now yes and we just had two gunshots now and the, uh, there was a shout that ogbe ogbe that means he ran the animal ran away with the shot or the shot missed yeah. so we just have to position ourselves very well and i think there is one adaja very close to where we are and one agbala is over down, down there the yeah down the river there okay there is a river over there yeah yeah i can feel the uh fresh the fresh, air. fresh air so we'll still wait here and be patient hopefully today we'll catch a lot a lot of bush meat okay we just had a gunshot very close to this place. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so there is a shout, there was a Agbale shouting over there. So we need to move away from here. Yeah. We need to move away from here. They are moving down. So, so we have to direction of Agbale. Yes. 
what will follow. That is the dog. Okay, there is a dog over there. And a giant dog over there. Wow. I don't know how they do this, man. And it's not like they are wearing anything covering their body. No, no, no. So how do they manage to enter a thick forest? No, normally they are used to it. It's not about medicine. It's something they are used to. Their body is already, it's already fixed to just like, to, the, to, to, the, to the system. Oh my god. Huh? That is one of their Daja shouting. Yeah. With, and with this dog. is Agbale. It is gone. Agbale, it, is, it is gone. Oh, this is amazing. Guys, do you, do you see how deep that forest is? And that is how they enter. You can see there is no pathway there. It's not like they already created the pathway, pathway no. but there is no pathway there. They enter this forest as thick as it is. And it's not like they're wearing anything to cover their body or anything to protect their skin. Oh my God. <laughs> this is just amazing. So this is how they hunt in the old days. So it's very close to this place. And I don't know if you guys can see him. So it's, com it's, it's coming out here. It's coming out. You can see? Help! It's coming out. Look at how. Help! Help! Uh, you can see. Help! Oh, yeah, you can oh, move down, oh. right? He's going in again. Help! 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 Okay, there is a hunter coming right now. This is Agbale. Where don't sir? Okay. You can see all of them are positioned. We are positioned. We have three people over here. We have the number one guy here, another one over there, and one down, down there. You can see him, he's moving. Can you see that guy? He just moved in now. So they just signal to each other now, and they are moving very fast slowly in a good position you see they're just so quiet here the ones inside are making the noise so to scare all the animal and they want to run out to escape so if the animals are trying to run out to escape we have the agbale over here so they are all lined up here some are at the other side they already circled this place. Yeah. So when they come out, poor. So we've been hearing like, we've heard like three shots of gun now. We don't know if there has been a kill or not, yeah. but whenever there is a kill, you said someone comes, right? Yeah, they will call they will, Ashipa. They will call Ashipa to come and pick the meat. So the Ashipa is gonna go inside, get the meat, then come out. So there, there have been like few hunting that I've witnessed, whereas uh, they have to walk miles, right? Yeah. They have to walk miles. So I think today's own is quite different. They target this area, this particular area. So we are still waiting. Oh, I think they are about to catch one. Yeah. Boom! Can you hear that? You see? What does that mean? Oh boy, look at that. They are trying to tell all okay. the to stand still. To stand still. To get set. So, a bushman just run and he's coming up here. We have to create space for them so they could shoot.
Okay, one just escaped up here and they are looking for who to run. So they need someone at who can there's some, there's somebody Okay, there. there is someone over there. So this place is already circled. Wow. Can you hear their noise? What what are you saying? They are telling all the Agbale that they should say that the meat, the meat is coming to their direction. They should get set. Okay. And they should get set. They should get set. Okay. Oh, people see Koto. Mumbo Lenyi Oko. Okay. That is another Agbale. Okay, that's another that yeah. is here. It's positioned and there is a bush meat that ran through this side. So we are being careful and trying to see. So the story behind that thing the story behind was at the neck of this dog is that they can recognize that is their dog coming, right? And they can recognize that that is the dog coming. That's that's yeah. how they put OG. It's called OG. To their neck, so they can know that is a dog coming, not animal. Hey, bro. Yeah. We're gentle. Ah, that's why I'm bored. I'm afraid I'm going to get a lorry bike. Eh. Then I see the motor bike. You know. I'm a guy. You both people are not talking like. Wow, lots of dogs. Look at that. I am Okay, so you have to remove the kilo and I remove them. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. So let's keep on see. <laughs> 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 Okay, I think we should go and stay there. We stay there. Yeah, let's yeah. let's let's go there. Guys, you see why I can't go inside. So there are a lot of shooting man. So you know there are wide spreads of people, they are professionals, they've been doing this for a very long time. I just can't come and go deep inside the forest. So, even where I am man, I'm sweating, you can see the heat, everything. And look at these people, they are going inside a forest that is not even controlled. So they are well prepared and they have the voodoo for it as well. Even though they've been doing this for a very long time. I can't say they are just ordinary people. They are not ordinary people. They are beyond ordinary people. And the stamina they have, man, it's insane. Because you can't just enter a thick forest and be running around shouting for hours. You can't do it, trust me, you can't do it. They've been doing it, and I think they've been doing it for a very long time. That's why it's easy for them, bro. For so, donkey years now. Yeah, you see? So, just someone like me, even if I go to the gym like four hours a day, I can't just go inside the forest, man. You can see how I'm dressed. I'm like, I think you guys don't know. Sir, come on, recall, let them see how I'm dressed. Okay, I'm recording. Yeah, I'm recording already. You see, like this is just to protect all the insect bites and all, and double top with hand glove so that the last time, because the last time I went, I followed them, 
I got different kind of insect bites and my body starts swelling okay. after two days. And I think even with drug and all, I think I suffered that for like a week plus. So right now I'm fully prepared. I just went to get this and <laughs> yeah, we are here. And I'm going to stay till they finish their hunting today. Okay. So let's keep hunting. <laughs> But when I came into this village, that's when I met this hunter. Okay. So I decided to join them to know how, how do they hunt, how do they do this, how do they do this. And I found out it's a, it's a talent, it's a gift. It's not about person doing medicine. You have to know the rules, no, yeah. the rules and regulation. But at times they do have, you yeah. must know about leaves. Yes. You must know about leaves. It's, it's not just honorary eye. You yeah, have to add voodoo to it. Yeah, you have to have some little that. Okay, if you have a snake bite in the in the bush, mm -hmm. how do you cure yourself? You must know about mm. all those things immediately. Wow. So, and and most of them they know it. That's interesting. To be an hunter, you must know it. So, guys, they just caught one. I heard they caught one big gala or, or antelope. I think it's antelope. Yeah. I think that's antelope. So, I should be careful. Oh, we going. <sighs> Oh my god, I'm tired, man. <laughs> so, we're coming from it's just like a hill, you see, it went down deep down, so we have to climb up again. And we're going to another side where the Agbano, are we? Agbano, right? Or what you is it? Ag Agbale, okay. The Agbale caught an antelope and we're going there. Ooh. Oh damn. <laughs> Look at that, I'm breathing. Can you hear? Oh my god. Oh my god, look at the kill. The kill is insanely big. I can't imagine them killing such animal in this forest. <laughs> Let me show you. So this is them bringing it oh my god this is this is big oh my god wow look at how beautiful this is damn wow this is so this this kind of what what's the name of this? Agbori, what do you call it? Kile Mankwe. Agbori. So they said it's like a traditional. Oh, they call it. You mumbo don't. Chile don't suppose man do bury. Abi don't need story. Oh, 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 and this is extremely, extremely big. We still have the one that bigger that is bigger than this. Really? One. Yeah, that is over this five times. Ah, look at the horn. This is the horn, man. I there. think this one is the, is the female or male. Oh, this is the, this the, is the male. This is the male. And the male. you're still young. Can you raise the leg off, please? I saw something. So what's this? There's something here, like a hole, oh, yeah, and it's here as well. Yeah. So, well, a thick balls. This is a oh my god, this strong and heavy. This like it's gonna weigh like 60 or 70 because I can hardly lift it as well. And where are you gonna put it? Where do you want to put it? So I can assist you. We can't carry it. We can't carry it, so we should just leave it there. Is it okay to leave it on the ground? Yeah, I'm going to cover it. Alright. Yeah. So they are hanging it up because of the dogs. Uh, 
So these are the cartridge inside. So did you combine all of my Oh my okay. Okay, can you yato? Okay, they are different. Alright. So the this is AA, So they are So the AA has a very big seed. Why the BB has a very small smaller one? Yeah. So this is a male, right? A corn. A corn lily. O be a nichi be. Hmm. Damn. This is big. Wow. Okay. This is another small one. Yeah, small one. So I got to size one. See that one. Oh boy. So let's call it lily. Yato. This one is kind of brown. Inu. We have three bush meat. Yeah. Okay, three um, grass cutter and this deer. I don't know the name. So the hunting is still going on, and we are still storing them here. So, guys, I can't go inside again. So don't nail me on the cross for that. Uh, but they are still they are still hunting and they are still bringing out more bush meat. So it's uh, four thirty already, and hopefully they will come out before the end of the day or before everything goes dark, so I can take nice and cool pictures and round up the videos. But we will still be here till like night, right? Because. They are still going to ride it and give everybody their own share. So let's keep waiting and hoping they get more bush meat. Okay, what do you so, um, trying to eat this one now. Mm. I plug the mango here. Yeah. We'll be here, Nothing to do. And they've caught real big things. Like, but it was raining, so the raining made them leave the forest so now they are out and they will start with the sharing and all
So everyone is sharing their experience of what happened in the forest. So it's like an awesome experience and everybody is sharing it. So they are about to, I think they are going to burn it. They are going to share it within themselves. And they have a lot, like they are much. So if it's not of this rain, they, should, they would have caught a lot, but you know, when the rain started, they just had to leave the forest and then come out. And now they are about to start with the burning. so guys we are done you can see everybody is happy they are happy they got something they caught something and there are still more on things that they are still going for i think the next one thing is in i think in the next two days or so so this is how it is this is how happy they are with each other and it's fun really really fun Ashipa Dikaria. Dikaria. Yeah, Dikaria is called the Ashipa. This is my own part of the game. I got this meat. <laughs> uh, this is uh, the grass cutter skin, why this is from the big meat. So I'm taking bush meat home. Erotumbo. This is the hunting video you've been craving for.
So guys, you can see how everything went down. And because of the rain, we couldn't, we couldn't get enough meat, enough bush meat. But you can see they did, they really did the number. So thank you so much guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. If you like this video, let me know in the comment section. If you want me to do more of this vlog, more of this hunting video, let me know in the comment section. So more of this video coming your way. I love you. Have a wonderful day. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Okay? Subscribe. Bye.